the Senate Public Accounts Committee has voiced its growing frustration over the persistent non-cooperation of certain ministries, departments and agencies, MDAs, in responding to audit queries raised by the Auditor General's report for the year ended December 31, 2019. The chairman of the committee, Sen Senator Ahmed Wadada, addressing journalists on Tuesday, read the riot act uh, to MDAs that shunned invitations by the Senate. The committee expressed its disappointment with these agencies, emphasizing that their failure to attend public hearings and respond to queries hindered the committee's efforts to submit a timely report to the Senate plenary. Senator Wadada further warned that the Senate will leave no stone unturned, adding that there is no agency that is above the law. Among the MDAs identified as particularly non-compliant are the Office of the Accountant General of the Federation, Nigerian Mining Cadastral Office, Federal Inland Revenue Service, Nigerian Upstream Petroleum Regulatory Commission, and others. I have called you this afternoon as co-partners, not only in our committee's proceedings, but as constitutionally empowered workers slash servants in the vineyard of constitutional democracy to express our concern and display you at the attitude of some MDS and their CEOs towards our invitations to defend the audit queries raised against them in the Auditor General's annual report for the year ended 31st December 2019. It is worthy to state that the committee commenced the consideration of the audit report in October 2023 with a view to presenting its report to the plenary. However, some agencies have willif willfully failed to honor invitations to defend their written responses to the audit queries as submitted to the committee secretariat. Besides the demand for submission of written responses to audit queries, part of the committee's rules of engagement requires that accounting officers attend the committee's public hearing to respond to questions arising from the analysis of their submissions, which in turn forms a basis for informed decision on the matter by the committee. Gentlemen and ladies of the press. He said failure to appear would attract unpalatable consequences from the committee and the Senate. Nobody in this country is over the law. I mean, nobody is above the law. And whoever you are, whatever you think you are, Nigeria makes you. So you cannot be greater than Nigeria. And this is Nigeria. The National Assembly is Nigeria. We are sitting on mandate of Nigerians to protect their interest for the good of all. So from this point, any MDA that fails to appear to respond to invitation to defend the queries as regards to that MDA, we will do the needful. And of course, uh, the queries are here. For today, we are not reading the queries of the various uh, uh, MDAs, but it is important that the public knows that this is where we are. And from this point, we will call the bluff of whoever chief executive that fails to respond. We are on this side once more, sitting on position of mandate. We are not upon keys. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.